Hi guys and guys, it's today the new Resident Evil Part 7 Biohazard is coming out. So um, you see me making myself ready for buying the new part and guys, I can't wait to start with it. I took free today and tomorrow, uh, which means heavy gaming and heavy gaming it will be. And we're ready to go. Three, two, one. people out there in the zombie land it's again me your girl moonberry and welcome back to my channel guys you may recognize a couple of things first the background has changed and i really hope you like it second i might have a kind of a red eye syndrome but it doesn't hurt so let's get over it then i maybe i used a bit too much highlighter but it is what it is and there are things worse than that. Why I make a video today? It's release day of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. <laughs> I played Resident Evil 1, which plays in an old mansion, which is perfect for a horror game, and Resident Evil 4, which main difference to the um, former parts is that there are no zombies but infected people. It was the burner. Those two games are really um, exceptional good. I mean, this these two games, they brought me into gaming. After part four, um, they became more and more just shooting games with, with horror elements and if I want to play a shooting game, I will buy a shooting game and not Resident Evil. In my opinion, what made Resident Evil 1 and 4 special is that there has been a change of atmosphere. There were parts full of action and running and shooting. <laughs> And then there were um, um, sequences uh, with a kind of a silent, quiet, but um, also threatening atmosphere. It was such a good balanced mix, you know. And that's also what the, the gaming community criticized at Capcom. Capcom, they made the game. Um, that the, the elements which made uh, the older part so special were completely missing in the new part. So I really have high expectations on that one. On that one, I hope um, it's a kind of back to the roots. Um, that's why I'd like to take you with me. I don't have any program to make any a proper a proper let's play for you, but I want to share my first-hand exper experiences with you anyway so I guess I have to work anything out and we will see how it goes thanks for your time I hope you enjoy what I will do and well three two one Yay! Yay! Oh, I cannot wait. are we her husband am I married we are Ethan and this is our wife. Oh. Stay away. Stay away? Okay, then goodbye, the game is over. Well, it was a very good game. I liked the graphic very much. Okay, no, just joking. Just joking around. Hey, it's, uh, it's Ethan. Uh, I don't know. Guys. You see this graphic? Looks so real. Can we? Can we drive? Oh no, we just can look around. 
So okay, let's try left stick. Ah, left stick is moving around and right stick is looking around. Okay, can we run? Ah, okay, let's run. Ah, wow, okay, that scared the shit out of me. Geronimo! Open. Okay, we can't come in this way, so I guess it has to be that way. <gasps> wow, you can open it. With me, which means I can open. But do I want to open it? That's the question. But yeah, I will. Join us. No. It depends on who you are. Um, accept her gift. Okay, and that gift would be? Oh, look, nice. Hi. Hi. Ah, go away. Mosquitoes or flies or... Ah, ah, ah. Okay, I'm almost sure you can't hear it, but the, the music changed and got a little creepy. Did you see him? Right there was a person. Where is this guy? Oh dear God, what is that? Do you, can you see? No, you can't, you can't see. But here, it's like round blades. But we have no... Yeah! Where did this guy go? Can we jump? Okay, I guess we have to jump. I would go back and call it a day. A wonderful property for the more fucked up type of persons. It's so dark in here, I don't dare to go in. <laughs> okay, let's go in. Hello? <gasps> Why? Okay. Why did I close the door? You cannot open again? No, no, it's closed. We can't go out again. I never would have closed, never would have closed the door behind me. Open the door. <laughs> open. What was that? Hello. Is anybody here? Um, my car broke down and I'm just searching for a phone or a knife. Uh, well, what is around the corner? Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. ah, wah, wah, wah. In two years, more than 20 missed persons. Okay. Hey, Mr. or Miss, I don't have a problem with missed persons if you don't make me one of them. There was one man and he was tall and I want to know right now where he is. I'm pretty sure he's something upstairs and I have no weapon. Um, and I closed the door behind me and, and everything is dark and gross. Yeah, close it. No, I don't want this. Oh dear God, and here is only blackness behind this door frame. <gasps> you know what? I go inside and but I close my eyes and if something is coming after me, I will hear it, but I won't see. So. That's a good plan. 
Close my eyes. Whoa! Mirror, mirror on the wall. It isn't creepy at all. <gasps> no, I didn't want it to open it. I just... Ah, okay. Where is the guy? Guy? Why would I play a piano in a dark, creepy house in a world where zombies are normal? <sighs> For the sake of... <sighs> okay, who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Uh, the owner. Mm -hmm. Where is the owner? Buried in the garden. Okay, we found the videotape. That means running downstairs and watching it. Well guys, that was me playing Resident Evil 7 Biohazard Part 1. I hope you enjoyed what you've seen because I certainly did. Capcom did an exceptional good job for what I can say. I hope you'll stay tuned for part 2. Thanks for your time. Bye.